Would you consider yourself a biohacker? Yes, I am. Your particular category is enhancing your cognitive abilities. Talk to me about that. When it comes to stimulation, I mainly use uh, either electrical current or I use uh, pulsed magnetic field or I use lasers or I use the combination of any of the three. They help you to optimize your brain activity, to remove any negative patterns, including anxiety, including mild depression, including stress, uh, including an ability to concentrate, uh, including uh, overload of your memory when you can't memorize uh, anymore. So what do these things mean? They are positions for measurement. So what exactly did this just do? I just took a snapshot of your uh, brain waves. Is it good or bad? Overall, always fine, but what we can do uh -huh. is we can attempt to elevate beta more on the left. So it should make you feel uh, more comfortable, more calm, and at the same time more focused and clear. Right now I'm looking at frontal prefrontal areas. So I'm applying both magnetic and laser stimulation. You're sure that's safe? Yes. Okay. So I should be like more concentrated. Are you? I feel very mellow. And now we will see what does it look like. There's a dramatic shift in delta. This right here means I'm a little bit more fo I'm, I'm more alert. Yes. So what are the risks of using your own body for experimentation? Even though accidents may happen, I would say that my risks are calculated and uh, I would not feel more unsafe than, for instance, uh, if I were riding a motorbike or not to mention any of the extreme sports. Let's talk future, right? Could you target certain parts of your brain to potentially make you like somebody, make you fall in love? I think so. It's only a technical difficulty to do so, but theoretically, I don't see a difference in this case between uh, love or uh, musical ability or mathematical ability or uh, anything else out there or just, or, or just visual perception.